Hello, this is John Locke. Today we're going to talk about rich snippets, what they are, and specifically the position zero rich snippet. You've probably already seen rich snippets in Google search results. You probably just didn't know what they were called. So about six or seven years ago, they might have been a photo that would have appeared next to a search result, say if you were searching for a recipe or if there is a particular author of an article, you might have seen a photo next to that. Today, rich snippets take many forms. For the sake of brevity, we're going to say that rich snippets are anything outside of the 10 blue links, the map pack, and the ads that are at the top of the page. And it's anything that's a special feature, could be a call out of different things. Say you're searching for a movie and there is a big you know, box with that movie at the top with the cast. Let's say you're searching for a place or a city or something like that. You might see a whole carousel of different cities if you're searching for a celebrity. But for today, what I want to focus on is what they call the position zero rich snippet. Now this appears at the very, very top of the page and it will be a big box where it calls out a section of text from a result. And it's a link, obviously, because it's a big call out. A lot of people click on that or they go to it. It's Google's way of delivering the information that they think people are looking for with that particular search query in a way that's concise. So how do you get that position zero rich snippet? The position zero rich snippet. Generally, this is going to be from a result that's already on page one of Google. Step one of getting the position zero rich snippet is getting to the first page of Google. Step two is formatting the information in a way to where it's easy for Google to just take that information and just slap it up there. Uh, some of the things that we've noticed, sometimes you'll see it's a, you know, a sentence or two that they pull out of text that answers a specific search query. Sometimes it's a list of things that you're searching for and it will show an excerpt of that list. Let's say you're already on page one, you're trying to knock out the, the big call out rich snippet that's already in position zero up above all the rest of the regular results. Because that one does appear like later below in the list too, in the regular 10 blue links. Look at how it's formatted on their page. If it's a list of items, is it using a proper HTML markup? Is it marked up in the proper way as a unordered or ordered list? If it's not in a list format, like what you're trying to knock out of the way, is it formatted in a way where it's got headlines like H2s and then some paragraphs beneath? Generally, what I've seen with the position zero rich snippet, having gotten them for my, both myself and for clients, what I have noticed, you want that HTML markup to be pretty sim simple. You want it to be uh, pretty basic. You want to clean out any clutter. Google just wants to be able to parse that information without having to do a lot of reconstruction on the actual HTML markup. Those are things that I've noticed. So get to page one, analyze like what your competitors are doing, see what you can improve. Basically, if you're going for an excerpt of text, if an excerpt of text is what your competitors have in position zero already, I would say make sure that the page that you are trying to get up there break up the text on your page with you know headlines and then you know a few paragraphs and then break it up again with another headline a few paragraphs if you've got a list of items make sure that that markup is is clean and simplistic to where google can just take that information and put it in there table information google also will take that sometimes and put it in that position zero place so there you go you have to get to page one first clean html markup is something that Google can quickly scan. It doesn't need to do a lot of work. They can just take it and put it in there and it makes sense. So look at how it appears on the page and strip out any of the styling to see if it makes sense. These are things that, that you can definitely do once you get to page one. Uh, you wanna try and get that advantage and get that position zero rich snippet. My name's John Locke. My business is Lockdown Design and SEO. We help manufacturing and industrial firms with their SEO, helping them get more organic traffic through Google and Bing. 
And as a result, they get more requests for quotes. If you have an SEL question that you'd like us to answer, go ahead and leave it in the comments below. We'll answer it out in a video for you. If you're getting value from this channel, I would ask you to subscribe. Tell your friends too. Peace. The trick is getting to page one.